This Rapid Sheet Metal Tech Tip reviews sheet metal hems with a focus on the closed hem. Hems are formed using a press brake by rolling the sheet metal material onto itself. There are three motivating factors for designing a hem into a sheet metal part. To conceal rough edges and burrs, to make a part more aesthetically pleasing, and to reinforce edges. There are four common types of hems, the closed hem, the open hem, the teardrop hem, and the rolled hem. This tech tip will focus on the closed hem. The closed hem is the most commonly used hem, as well as the least difficult to form. In order to form a closed hem, there are a couple of requirements. One, forming a closed hem is best with material that is between 40 and 125 thousandths of an inch thick. And number two, the outside length of the material must be a minimum of four times the material thickness of the sheet. Now note, forming a closed hem with aluminum that has a material thickness over 125 thousandths of an inch thick is not recommended, as the material tends to stress and may fracture during forming. The first step in forming a closed hem is to form the sheet metal to 145 degrees. Then, the sheet metal is flattened onto itself. Here is a live action look at how a closed hem is formed. So, to review, hems are generally used to conceal rough edges and burrs, to make a part more aesthetically pleasing, and to reinforce edges. Forming a closed hem is best with material that is between 40 and 125 thousandths of an inch thick. This concludes our Rapid Sheet Metal Tech Tip closed hems. Thank you for watching.